superstars, I'm Sue and welcome to my channel, Reviews with Sue. If you're a returning subscriber, thank you so much for coming back and supporting our channel. And if you're new here, welcome. I'm Sue and I hope you consider hitting that subscribe button. So would you like to know what today's unboxing is all about? Well, can't you see? It's Michael's Crab Bag Day. So if you want to know what's inside these 18 boxes, yes, then keep on watching. Doing reviews just like I do. Hanging out with your friend Sue. It's Sue. And I'm back. Yes, today is Michael's Crab Bag Day, so yay! I'm so excited. I just love this time of year. It's kind of like Christmas. So, if you are not familiar with Michael's Crab Bags, first what I want to do is do a huge shout out to the Freebie Guy. Guys, that's where you can find out when these grab bags go on sale. The Freebie Guy over on Instagram, check him out. He's always posting tons and tons of things that are like on sale at different places, and he announces when the grab bags or boxes are going to be out. So, if you're not familiar with the grab bags, what it is, each one of these boxes was five dollars between myself and my girlfriend we actually purchased 18 grab bags we did we each got nine of them so what we did is we both go in separate directions there are a ton of different michaels in our area so we hit five different stores we got like three or four from each store so we did not take or you know all the ones that they did have there and a lot of them had like stacks one store we didn't get till till close to 11 o'clock and they still had a stacks of them left so we went ahead and we grabbed a few from there or she did i should say because that was her last stop and then we met for lunch at panera bread now we are back filming at her house this time because for those of you that follow me already you know that I have recently moved and it is a three hour drive from where I live to where I used to live so I came down late last night in a huge storm spent the night for a couple of hours then we got up bright and early so we could get our bag so I'm super excited these boxes usually come out at the end of each season so what, what you want to do is you can always go into your Michaels watch it when they things drop down to like 70 80 90 percent off that's when they're going to get ready to throw things in these boxes and then they sell them for five dollars each I I personally have always felt that they were always worth the price. Sometimes you get some duds, but it's all right. It's $5, guys. Now, between me and my friend, I have um, three siblings, and then I have 10, 12, I think I have 12 nieces and great nieces and nephews. So I have lots of little ones from the ages of four to 18, I believe, or 17, I think is the oldest nephew that I have, great nephew. And then my friend here that does do the... Um, boxes with me. Her name is Angelica and I always want to give her a huge shout out because she's like my right hand man. She is my gal. So I am just so excited that she does these with me. Now she is from a family that has, she has six or seven other siblings. So she has like a ton of nieces and nephews. So after we do the video, we split everything right in half. And then we take each half to our own homes. We go through it. We give, you know, we make get baskets, you know, for that teacher's thing that we did last year, we gave a ton of that to the teachers and oh my gosh, they were so excited. So it's always really cool. We do end up selling some of the things in garage sales so we can try to recoup some of our money back. But you know, like even at my garage sale, I still had some teacher stuff. And when they told me they were a teacher, I'm like, oh, here, take this, take this. So I was actually like giving them tons of stuff. So they really like my garage sale because they get free stuff. And who doesn't love free stuff? But without further ado, if you haven't subscribed to my channel already, I really wish you considered, especially if you love Michael's boxes, if you like unboxings, if you like a few reviews because I don't do a ton, but I do some, I would really love it if you could hit that subscribe button and help a girl out so and also i'd also love you guys to leave comments down below if you want to leave them all the way through the video feel free if you see something that's really cool give it a shout out and say hey sue that's really cool or i've got a great diy for you i would love to hear all of your suggestions so i'm three minutes in i've got 18 boxes to go through and i sure hope we can do it in a reasonable amount of time so i am going to go quite quickly through these boxes now some of the boxes were taped some of them weren't taped um, there was barely like anybody in the store. It was like really weird this year. So like I said, I'm going to go quickly. My friend is over here. Angelica, say hello. Hello. So there's Angelica. She, she, Hi, she's not an invisible person. She's really right there across the room for me. Angel. So, the, and she's actually Angel L. If you, um, if she follows any of your channels already, I'm just reaching over in case I do need my glasses, but we are going to start off with yes, spring flowers. So we've got some spring flowers right here. What are the retail values on these? Let me check it out. I'm going to take a little peek, but we aren't going to take too long on it. So these flowers run. Oh my gosh. I can't even find the little sticker on it. Uh, $4, $3.99. So there is one bushel there. We've got another one. I've got another box to me. So she's just going to slide the boxes 
as we go through. So we got a lot of these yellow flowers. So there's that, there's that. And I'm sure guys, in a future video, I'm probably gonna do a giveaway with some of the items in these boxes. So make sure, you know, you keep an eye out for that. It's probably gonna be in a couple of weeks. But, um, cause I got, I'm, I'm still moving into my house, guys. I've got millions of boxes and my husband's going to kill me, kill me when he sees how many more boxes I'm going to be bringing into our home. So we have that. Oh, this is something cute. This is $9.99. Look, it's like a little metal pail and it's got little flowers. That is adorable. I love that. That is so cute. Oh, and we got two of them. So guess what that means? One for my friend and one for myself. Okay. So look at this guys. We've got tons more of these flowers. I'm just going to kind of rush through these cause we have a ton to get through. So we're going to go there, there, there. Okay, we got another one of these cute little pots. Then what we have here is a felt banner craft kit. So I love getting kits. My nieces and nephews love getting kits. And this says, never stop exploring. So it's just a little kit that they can do. And this one is $4.99. Ooh, ooh, now this looks really cool. This is a balloon backdrop kit, red, white, and blue. So this is something from 4th of July. So the items you're going to be seeing in these boxes most likely are back to school. They're going to be like the spring flowers or spring signs um, and back to school stuff. So yeah. And then there's a 4th of July there. That is really cool. Oh my. We got a stack of signs. It says hooray for the USA. So we have these wooden signs right here. And this is valued at $8, or excuse me, $9.99. And it looks like I have like three more of these. Oh gosh, there's a lot in this little bag, the box here. So these are just some charms. I'm not sure what you use them for, but there's some like little puff ball charms there. Ooh, we got some cookie cutters, yay. Oh, look at, you got the United States, you got the American flag, you got another one of those. Oh, I love getting cookie cutters and stuff like that. Ooh, now this is a red, white, and blue party balloon garland kit. So this is a little bit different. Ooh, these are cool. More flowers. We got another one of these little kits here. We got another kit. And that's the thing I wish they would kind of like separate the thing. So when we get a box sometimes, guys, it'll have like all the same thing in the same box. I wish they would try to separate them. Not that I'm trying to be choosy or anything, but then that way we wouldn't get as many boxes probably. So now this one says everything will be okay. So there is another sign right there. I love getting the crafts. Uh, okay, I have no idea what that is. Okay, now this here says glitter bubbles to go. I never heard of such a thing. So it says it's bubbles to go. I don't know what it is, but it looks pretty interesting and it's got a value of $3. So we've got one of those. I think this one, um, it may have went flat. Oh, maybe we should pull that one out because it might be um, leaking or something here. Oh, and then we even got like a price tag, $4.99. I'm telling you, when they take this stuff off the shelves, they even bring the price tags down with it. Oh, we got like a little bouquet of flowers there. Ooh, more 4th of July, yes. It seems like we didn't get much 4th of July stuff last year. These are gel clings, so cute. So there's that. We got another one. Oh, now, oh, this one. Oh, yeah, I forgot to say it. Super stars. Yes, we got some super stars to go on the clings. And then this one's like little hearts for 4th of July. This one here. Oh, it lights up and it's already lit up. So I don't know if you can see the lights are already going. So let me turn that off. But it is just a little star that you would paint yourself. A little, you know, DIY, DUI, DIY. DIY. It's one of those things. <laughs> I get so excited, guys. So I apologize. So there is another one of those. Oh, this looks really cool. Look at it. It's got, it's a dry erase board. And it's got like Monday through Saturday on here. That is super duper cute. And this is valued at $19.99. That's great for, you know, planning and stuff. So we may be fighting over that one. <laughs> what we do is we split everything in half. And then the things that are like odd things, then we take turns picking things out of a pile. It's really fun, actually. I should do a video on it, but it would take like hours. So you <laughs> definitely don't want to see that. Okay, then we have a sign here. And it says, this kitchen is seasoned with love oh my gosh isn't that cute guys it is adorable yes it is that's fun okay then we got another sign and it says stay grounded so we have a sign like that and then we've got another sign that says the secret ingredients is always love and isn't that true yes like i said my husband's gonna kill me so hopefully he'll <laughs> he'll still love me after all of this okay then we have here is some cotton cord and I don't even know what cotton cord is used for, but it's really pretty. It's got the nice pale colors there. And then this here is a honeycomb soap mold insert. Interesting. So if you're a soap maker, which I would love to try to get into. Actually, my sister's friend does soaps and bath bombs, and I love, I would love to try to figure out, you know, how she does that or maybe do a little class with her. So that was box number one. Moving on to box number two. Let's see what we have. We have... It looks like a table runner. Oh, and it's super pretty and very spring. This thing is valued at 
$14.99 and it's got all these little little balls here at the bottom and they're just like super fringy and fun. So we have one of those. Okay, we got another one of those. We have, oh, we have one that came apart. Oh, so this is what the whole thing looks like and it is long. So this will look really nice in the springtime. I love those colors because you guys know I love me some pinks. And then there's the rest of it there. Oh, it looks like we've got a little macaron and it looks like a little squishy there. Oh my, we got like a whole bunch of stuff in here. So what are these? This is called the ORB Jelly World, Worlds, Worlds Outer Space Odyssey um, Turns Water Into Magic Jelly. I have no clue what this is. Not a clue whatsoever. It does not have a price tag on it that I can see, but we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. This whole box art is this. Is it all the same? And they look like, yep, I think the whole box is the same one. Let's look. Yep, it looks like the whole thing is the same one. So if you have any idea what these are and what they're used for, let me know. That's the front and there is the back, but I don't see any price tags on it. So we, like I said, there's a whole bunch of those. And then we have, what are these? Poly Burlap Mesh. I'm not sure what we use this for, but it looks pretty neat. So there is that right there, and it is $9.99. And we have this color. We have this color. It's kind of like a like a beige or maybe like a deep maroon color. Then we have a pretty pink, which you know I love. I wish these were those things that, at first I thought they were the things that you put in drawers so your things don't like slip around in the drawers because that would have been super cute. We have a pretty blue one. We have this one here, and then we have a pink one. So that is everything in box number two. The other thing, guys, I'd love it if you could comment in the comments below if you think that these boxes are worth $5 each. Let me know. Oh, let's see here. I gotta get my scissors out because this one is still all taped up. Like I said, some of them were taped up, some of them weren't. And let's me see what we got in this one. Ooh, looks like we got some more flowers. Yes, we love our flowers. So we've got a couple little miscellaneous pieces here. We got one here. We have one here. Some of them are kind of like falling apart. <laughs> got one there. I'm just gonna kind of fly them through if that's okay, guys. Oh, look, this is a cute little pot there. This one is $9.99, crazy, just for a little pot. And I know when I say the prices, nobody ever pays full price for these things. But you know, it's still, you know, it's kind of fun to say this, this, this flower is worth $4.99, crazy, totally crazy. All right, we got more. Let's see, I'm just gonna cut. Oh, we got another pot. So here's one in peach. Here's one in peachy pink. Here's one in peachy pink again. <laughs> they have these cute like little little bouquets. It's almost like something a little bridesmaid would, um, or not bridesmaid, like a little flower girl or something would carry. Oh, and then there's some there. And then we've got a little bit of greens. We got some more greens. Uh, we've got, what do we got? What do we got? We got some more flower pots. We got some more flowers there. We got some, um, are these onions? I believe these might be onions. Uh, I think that's what they are. Does it say? Yes, this is a bag of onions, <laughs> but they don't smell like onions. Okay, this one looks like it's seen its better days. Here we have a little pot that the items fell out of. And then we've got some more flowers here, some more miscellaneous. I think this is like the scraps of what they had left over, I think. That's what it's looking like to me. Oh, this is like a little air plant there. And then we have a loose flower stem there. And then this says, a hundred acts of kindness. Uh, it looks like this is like a back to school thing here. So this is something that you could, you know, use in your classrooms. And then on the other side, it says, offer to help, say nice things, listen when others are speaking, be happy for others. Okay, so on and so on. So we've got two of those. And nope, it looks like we got more of those, guys. We've got another one. We got another one. So then we got two more of those. So that makes four of those. Then we have this here is a, a color wheel. Oh, so this is like a color wheel right there. So that could be helpful. That might be helpful to me. Okay, then we have here, it says, um, schedule. So there is just like a little border that says schedule. And then down here, oh, this looks cool. So this is a yarn pillow craft kit valued at $14.99. It looks like that might be one of those like rug hooking things. I know when I was a kid, guys, we used to do these like all the time. Okay, then here we oh, have- Oh, it's a pizza slice. Oh, oh, I didn't even realize that. She just, my friend just said it's a pizza slice. And you're right, it is. Look, it's pizza. I didn't even notice that. Now this here, I don't even know what it is. This is a DIY modern mini room piece. It says loft, but I'm not really, 
Oh, oh my gosh, guys. Like, look, it's like when you have like a little dollhouse, this is like some of the pieces for it, like to put the little room together, I'm assuming. So there is that item right there. And this one, I don't see a price on it. So we got one of those. Oh, we got two just the same. Oh, but wait, there's more. We have a whole townhouse. So we've got the townhouse that goes with it. That is super cool. And this box is like really heavy. So this is like some good wood and uh, yeah, does anybody need a, a playhouse? So we have that. So that was the next box. Sorry about all the boxes getting shipped around, but you know, we got, we got things to do and people to meet and, and, and boxes to get through. Lots of boxes. Okay, we got some more flowers. Okay, hopefully these ones aren't as beat up as the last batch. So we've got flowers, more flowers, 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 flowers. Oh, this one is just like a little squishy kind of thing here that must have had a vase at some point or another. And some more flowers, more flowers. Sorry, I'm just flying through all these flowers. This is in a cute little pot. Uh, let's see, we got another handfuls of flowers. We have another, now this one's called the Nook, the Nook coin. So this is part of like that same, um, company that puts you know the little houses together so that should be interesting maybe we'll be getting some furniture to put in it soon and believe me i got enough furniture i got two houses worth of furniture into one house right now so we are wall to wall in furniture so we have that okay then oh we got some more flowers we got some more pots we got some more pots things are flying and oh my my pots are getting stuck to the tape inside the box we got some more of these cute little pots how much are these pots $5.99, guys. But these would be cute if you put them like all in a row. That would be, look really cute. We have that. Okay, then we got another. Now, it looks like we're getting into some more 4th of July items. We got another one of these really cool balloon banners, which, gosh, that is really cool. It has everything you need in there to put it together. Look, you can see like there's tape in there and there's like some kind of a cutter thing in there. There's extra couple rolls of tape in there. Hey, even if I just use the tape and blow up the balloons, who knows? Um, and then we have another one that's like a garland. Oh, this is going to be fun. This is a foam craft kit, and it looks like you're going to be making, like, some little sunglasses for the fourth. Another one of those. Okay, let's keep going. We got one, two, three, four, five, six. My whole family is going to be dressed for Fourth of July next year, and they're going to have to do their own little sunglass kits. Ooh, now these are cool. These are glow masks, and I believe these are the ones where you kind of, like, bust them, and then they start to glow in the dark, which is going to be super cool. And it looks like we got three of these. These are valued at $2.99. And yeah, this box was definitely worth it. I love 4th of July stuff. Mm -hmm. Now here we have, what is this? Is camper. this a, a little camper here? Oh, it's a but is it a shark camper? I don't know. It's got it's this a little thing. It's a VW bus with the surfboard on the roof. Okay, if you heard my friend, she's saying <laughs> it's a surfboard and it's a, B, BW, a VW bus. VW bug. Yes, so we have bus. that. Bus. Bus. It's a bus. <laughs> It's a bus and it's a bus, all in one. Cute. Here we have red, white, and blue. Excuse me, we have red, white, and blessed. Some wooden signs that you can do hand painting with. Here we have some soap molds. So we are going to be making us some soaps. Either that or we're going to maybe use them to make some bath bombs because I think that'd be really cool. Ooh, this is cool. This one has like little pineapples. Guys, you could probably even use these for like chocolates. You could use them for maybe like ice cubes or jello shots, which I always love to talk about because you guys know i'm always talking about jello shots not that i do them all the time we have another one of these little oh the little tag's still in it this actually does light up but it does have the little plastic strip that you pull out so that'll be cool then we got some more of these glitter bubbles to go which i still i'm not sure what they are but we've got three more packages of those i'm sure my nieces and nephews are gonna love those it might be going in their christmas box this year then we have some home fragrance oils valued at twelve dollars nine nine cents it comes in vanilla cinnamon Caramel latte, yes, and a spice cake. Oh my gosh, guys, those sound delicious. That's like great. That This right here makes the box to me. I mean, this is valued at $12.99. Even if I got it 40% off, it'd be what? Eight bucks still? So yes. Okay, then we have some wax melts. We got some peach wax melts. We got some more peach. Ooh, yes, we got some orange. Oh gosh, you guys know I love my fruits. Anything fruity, send them my way. Okay, then we have here, I'm not sure what the, this is. This is a... Um, it's a bracelet of some sort. So it looks like a little, little chain of bracelets. I don't know if they're already put together or you got to do something, but it does say charm, charm bracelet. So that's what it is. Oh, yay. We got another one of these signs. So we each get one now. Yay. So this is one of those dry erase boards again, which is super cool. And I definitely am going to use that. 
And then in the bottom of this box, last thing we have is this kitchen is seasoned with love. So guess what? We each get one of these cool looking signs too. So there goes that box. So now we're going high. We're going high, guys. Excuse my reach. In the next box, we have, oh, looks like we got us some more of those molds. So we might be getting a lot of duplicates here. So we've got more of the little molds right here that are supposed to be used for soap. And I just love that. I just love it because it's, it's very beachy. Like, I like that a lot. So there's two of those. We have two two more of those. Then we got a whole stack of something here. What are these? These are some mold press. Oh, I'm not sure how you use these, but they're mold presses. And it looks pretty interesting because look at that's how they're showing the mold. So, and that looks like chocolate. Do you guys think that looks like chocolate? Because I'm all about the chocolate. So I don't know if these are like reusable molds, but it looks like there's some like bigger letters and then there are some smaller letters in there too. These are valued at, they were, the small ones were $5.99. They went to clearance at $3 and then they made it their way into the box. Okay, this is Magic Grow Capsules. Oh, so you put these little capsules in water and then they're gonna like grow up to be something else. So that's pretty cool. So we've got, couple of those here. Are they all the same? Yes. Okay, it looks like we got a stack of these little guys here. Right here, some more of those. These are going to be like fun. And these are like all animals, I believe. Oh yeah, look. These are all the animals that these little pills are going to turn into. Because they do look like a pill, don't they? How fun is that? Yes. Okay, then we've got, oh, we got some more of these molds. Oh, and then we got one of, the, one of them actually, she just brought to my attention is, look, this one is like little vehicles there. It's like vacation-y stuff. Ooh, here's some more soap molds, but these ones are a little different. So here we've got a rainbow, we got a sunflower, and then we got some, like a square there. Nice, so we're gonna have a variety of those. And then there's like two more of the same thing, and these are valued at $4.99. Then what is this? What are you? Um, it is a plaster cloth. Okay. I don't know what a plaster cloth is, but it looks it looks interesting, I'm sure, for the person that uses plaster. And this was originally $10.49, and then it went down to clearance of $6, and then it made its way into our box. Okay, then we've got a little kit here. How fun. I love little kits. Um, play something, grab and go. It, the sticker or the price tag went right over, but it looks like it could be something kind of fun. Yes. Oh, and then we have some random light bulbs from Ashland. <laughs> they were $4.99, and then they made it their way into the box. So we got some light bulbs. This is something interesting. What is this? This is soap making. Oh, maybe you guys, we may be making some soap. I hope they put some wax in the, one of these boxes. So this is soap making fabrication. So I don't know. It's eucalyptus and apricot seed. So somehow you would use this with soap making. So we have one of those. Oh, this is a different one. This one is rose petals and lavender. Nice. So these you actually put into your soaps. Um, this one here is eucalyptus. And guys, there's like, oh, one of them must be open because all of a sudden I just got a whiff of it. So we have another one here. We have another one here. This one's actually, oh, yep, same one. Eucalyptus, eucalyptus. So there's another one. There's another one. I'm telling you, when they take them off the shelf, they just dump them all in the same box, which is crazy to me. Crazy, I tell you. Same one. Okay, we got some more molds. So now, I think these might be different because these look like some lemon or lime wedges. Another one up there. Another one there. <laughs> Wait, there's more. There's another one there. We got some more of these things for making soap. You know, the little scented things here. The eucalyptus, good stuff there. Then we have, oh, what do we got here? We got a little dolphin. This is Dimensions. I think it says Dimensions. And it looks like a little needlepoint kit. That's cute. Okay, then we have a random gift bag, which anyone can use. And then it looks like we have here a pride um, little um, tutu. So we have a pride tutu. I'm sure that's what this is. Or it could be used for Halloween as like a clown's outfit or something like that. Then here we have some chalkboard tape. Oh, that looks really cool. So it's chalkboard tape. It kind of looks like, you know, like a big roll of tape, but it's a uh, chalkboard. Okay, and then, oh, still a few more things in here. We have some more of these essential oils. Now, this one's different. This one's lavender, fresh mint, sage, citrus, and ocean waves. So that is a different one, which is cool. And then something here is heavy. What are you? Ooh, we have a, um, a six-hole punch. Oh, cool. There is a six-hole punch, and this Great. goes with the... Um, 
Recollections, I think that's how you pronounce it. Is it Recollections? Recollections. Um, so if you have like one of those binders, this is one that'll go in it. And it, I like in this color, guys. That color is so growing on me. It's my favorite. And then, oh, and it's, and it's my friend's. It's probably, that's why it's growing on me. Because she uses has that color all around her house and stuff. And so it just kind of grows on me. And then we have a Valentine's little cookie cutter heart there. So, and I love the cookie cutter hearts that have the little rubber on there. It is like my favorite. So let me ship that box out of the way. And now we're going to go back over here. So excuse my reach once again. Ooh, this one is, is sounding pretty heavy. Oh my. So it sounds like there may be some breakables in this one. And hopefully they're not broken, whatever's in here. So first we have is choose happy. So there is just like a little scroll sign here that says choose happy. Then we have a little needle point that says let's stay home oh i'm such a homebody these days guys i just love being home uh this is valued at 14 dollars 99 cents that's kind of crazy that seems really pricey okay then we have a g which stands for my last name then we have girl power yes girl, girl power everybody peace be with you all <laughs> so we have that now this is looks like a breakable this says talk dirt to me oh my god <laughs> That's so true. I'm like looking at it, but it's kind of scratched up a little bit here. I don't know if it's supposed to or not, but it's just like a little planter. So I'm assuming you can just put a little flower in there or something. And this is from Ashlyn. This has a value of $9.99. Okay, then we have the letter O, and this feels like it's glass, so we're going to have to be kind of careful with some of this stuff. Then we have a sign that says happiness is homemade. Yes, for all those people that love to do their own crafting. Okay, then we've got a couple of signs here. Home is where your, oh, uh, it says home is where your honey. And then it does have a little honeycomb there or a honey beehive there. So there are two of these signs here and these are both valued at $12.99 each. Yes. Okay. And we got a green R. So we got a random R. We got a random T. We got a random O. Some of these are metal. Some of these are um like plastic this one here feels like it has like acrylic on the outside and then it's wooden on the back and this is a w which is my friend's last name's first no it's not oh it's my friend's husband's first letter to his it's name the and then so we'll just give it to him we have an o this actually looks oh i was gonna say it looks like a toothbrush holder because it's got oh. holes in the bottom but no they're just kind of like glass and they're just like little o's like that i don't know what you would do with those exactly i guess if you had all the letters you could actually spell something so there's another o okay it looks like we got a couple of trinket trays and we have a q and a u do we have any q's or u's out there let me know <laughs> so we have that then we have a random little you know flower bundle right here then it looks like we got some oh this whatever it was it is some chalk but it looks like this kind of fell apart so i don't know if this chalk's going to be doing much much these days oh then we got some cool looking ribbon this is a value of nine dollars and 99 cents and it's a nice big roll and it has little cactuses all over it so we have that one we have another one we have another one we have another one these are all the cactus ones okay then it looks like we got some cool looking flower ribbon here so there's that ribbon there's that ribbon and then this is a different one. Oh, i like the color of this one and then there's some cool ribbon it has like a little fluffies here at the end and then we have a little teapot <laughs> trinket dish and it has a w on it which is glass so we got to be careful we have another ribbon in this pretty green color right there that has a little soft on the sides we have a random lemon yes does anyone need a lemon out there let me know do you need some fresh squeezed lemons okay then these little chalk things they were actually gonna they were supposed to be little popsicles for chalking and it looks like they're like all broken. It's such a bummer. There is like a whole bunch of them in here. And so it's probably because they put these in the bottom, guys. And then all that heavy stuff was on top of it. So we have another one there. Another one here. Another one here. Does anyone know what you could do with pieces of chalk? <laughs> I mean, I don't know if you can do anything. I mean, I guess the kids can just take little chunks of it and write on the sidewalk and stuff. But I would love to have that for when they come over to visit me. And now I'm living really close to them, so I'm sure I'm going to be seeing them, like, all the time. So there's, like, four more of them that are in here that are broken. Oh, here's one that's not broken. This is a, it's still chalk, but that's the design on that one. So that's pretty cool. So there's one of those. Let's see. That one did break in half. That one did break in half. And the rest in here are broken in half. And then, oh, what is this? Oh, these are little charms to maybe go on that bracelet. Look at how cute. There's like a little unicorn, there's a little bottle, there's a gem, 
And the last thing says magic. So there's that. So that's everything that is in that box. And then let's just keep on going to the right here. So I'm gonna bring another one in. Oh, okay. this one feels like it's kind of heavy. Oh, there was also a J in there. Ooh, I think we got a big hit for 4th of July, which I love. So this one here is what? It looks like we have a little tassel garland, red, white, and blue, USA, yes. Then we have here, um, what do we got? What do we got? Oh, we've got these little foils. So these are like where you can put like chocolates in or if you make candy or anything like that, you can wrap them in these little metal foil things there. We got a bunch more of the Klingons, guys. Klingon City. Klingon, Klingon. So we got some stars, as in superstars. Are you guys still with me? Because we got, you know, some more boxes still to go. We got hearts. We got hearts. We got stars. We got more foil. We got more hearts. These are all those Klingons. We got another big old balloon garland kit right there. Ooh, we got earrings. How fun. Oh, these are cute. These are valued at $7.99. And look, guys, they're all 4th of July themed. Yes. And then look here, we got the little 4th of July hat right there. Ooh, we got a bunch of jewelry in this one. So we have, um, wow, now these are some fancy. Kimmy from Kimmy's Boxes, she's gonna like these ones. <laughs> these are like the light up and they are superstars. Yes, they are. Then we got some more earrings. Oh, this is a good box. I like this one. Mm -hmm. My family is going to be dressed to the T next year for um, 4th of July. Then we have this one here. Um, let's see, what else we got in here? We got some more balloon stuff there. We have cookie cutters, USA, all the different letters. Oh, we got the we got the red truck ribbon. Yes, look at how cute that is. This is valued at $9.99, and this is super cute. Then we got another one of these big balloon things here that we're going to be making. Then it looks like we got a t-shirt in here. It looks like a kid's t-shirt, extra small youth, and it says, born to sparkle. Oh, my gosh. Oh, if this would fit Jessica Sparkles, I would definitely send it to her, but... I don't know if it's going to fit her. I mean, it may, it may fit like maybe half of me, but isn't that adorable? This was valued at $9.99. Oh, come on. I want some bigger sizes than that. Then we have another one of these garlands. This a is a um, wand craft kit. Oh, so this is a, a kit that you're going to put it together and then it's, um, you know, it's on those little sticks and you can kind of go like this, like a cheerleader. Okay. Yeah. Then we have the, um, oh yeah. She was saying that that t-shirt we just had, it has actually, it's in the shape of a unicorn, which I didn't catch that at first. Very cute. Okay, then we have that right there, another one of those. This is a USA, oh, this is, um. oh, they're foil balloons, nice. We got that, we got another one of these kits where you, you know, the little like pom-pom things, but they're little sticks. We got some cookie cutters. We got us another balloony thing to put together. We got another big balloon thing to put together. We have a, another balloon thing to put together. How much are these? $25. $25 a piece, guys. This one box, all this 4th of July, $5. <laughs> crazy, tell me, crazy. Um, we got some more of this really cute ribbon with the little red truck on it. That truck is so popular these days. We have another USA balloon kit right there to put up. And we have another garland. We have another one of the big balloons. Or big balloons, big um, <laughs> flags. That's what I meant to say. Garland. We have a class of 2021 randomly thrown in my 4th of July box for graduation. And my nephew, my great nephew, he just had his graduation party this past weekend. So if I would have had that, we could use that to make his cupcakes. We have like another whole stack of the Klingons for the um, stars, as in superstars. You know, I'm going to keep saying it. We have some more of the ribbon. Uh, this is like a random thing. What do we got? Oh, we got, oh, I don't know if it's going to be broken or it's tangled, but it looks like it is just like some wind chimes and they're just a little tangled, but I think it's going to, it's going to make it. And this is valued at $14.99. So that's pretty cute. And then we got another one of these balloons. We got another flag balloon. We have another, I guess the flag balloons weren't like a big hit this year. A flag balloon or the Klingons. And then, oh, what is this? This is a wreath accent and it is one of the um, red trucks with the flag. So if you make a wreath then you can attach this oh, to it. Cute. Or you could probably just, you know, set this on a shelf or something too. It would look really cute, I think. Okay, we got more ribbon for the truck. Another USA, another big, <laughs> oh my gosh, guys, how many, I'm gonna have these coming out of my ears. We have that one there. We have another one here. We have the flag cookie cutters as well as the United States. We have another one of the flags. We have, what else is in here? Oh, we got another couple more of these little earrings that are hats. Sorry, the one just flipped around, but it's the same one that you saw last time. Uh, oh, this one's different. 
So now this one is more of just the little heart that's for 4th of July. And what else we got in here? We got another one of these USAs. We got another Klingon in here. And then we have, uh, what do we got? What do we got? We got like, it's like, oh my. It's a 4th of July tutu. And does it do something else? Like, let's see. I think it's just a tutu. So this is in an adult large. This is going to fit me, guys. I am wearing this next 4th of July. No, it's I don't cute. know if I will, but it is darling. And then the last thing in our 4th of July box is another pair of earrings. So that's everything that was in that box. Now, Somebody. moving on to number eight. Is that right? Uh, scissors, scissors. I lost my scissors. Here you go, ma'am. Oh, okay, scissors are coming. This one is all taped up. I can't get into it. So, like I said, some of them were taped. Some of them weren't. Some we could poke our fingers through to try to see if we could feel anything in there that felt pretty good. <laughs> that did not sound right, did it? But we did. We kind of poked in there, you know, poking around a little bit. All right, here we got, oh, what do we have here? It looks like we might have some more uh, essential oils here. Botanical fragrance oils. So we have the Ocean Waves. And again, these are valued at $14.99. It looks like we have a bunch of these. More Ocean Waves. More Ocean Waves. Uh, this one is in, oh, this one's different. It's apple, pomegranate, strawberry, and orange. Yes. And now I love me my fruits. How many times can I tell you people that? Okay, then we have, we have another one that has the fruity flavors. We have another fruity flavors. We have another, this one is not. This one is vanilla, cinnamon, caramel latte, and spice cake. I think that is the one that we started off with. And then there's another one here, Ocean Waves. We have a few more. We have orange. This is the fruities. This is the fruities. Man, there's a lot of these in here. This is tropical fragrance. So this is, yep, that's the oranges. And let's see here. Yep, we got the oranges again here. We got a random, uh, another one of these ribbons that have the, uh, who are you again? You are a cactus. Yes, <laughs> that is a cactus if you didn't know. Okay, then we have here, ooh, we got some different stuff. This is color. So it is simple serenity um, colorants. So I don't know if this is used for candles, for candles or soap. It says used in soap base, bath bomb base, sugar and salt base, and bath salts. Protect your work area. Okay, so cool. So we got some colors that we can do our little project. This one says um, fragrance, perfume, and this is for soap making. And I don't see what flavors these are. Oh, eucalyptus and lemon. So we have that one there. Then we have another one here, and this one is in peach and cucumber melon. Oh, these are some good scents. So I'm gonna have to find my friend and we are, she's gonna have to teach me how to bake and use all this good stuff because I am now retired as you all know. So that means I got lots of time to do other projects. So I got another one of those guys, sorry. Okay, then we have, uh, this one is in peach and cucumber melon again. And then we have the lavender ocean waves packet there. Then we have some more of the molds right there. Man, we just need the wax. Then this is a party, uh, celebrate party coasters. So we got some little coasters Ooh. there. I don't know if they're all the same or not, but that is super cute. And then we have some pride little bedazzles and face gems for your face for the pride. And then we also have here some honey, almond, and coconut. Now that one's going to be good because coconut, I love the scent of coconut as well. Okay, then, oh my gosh, there's like a whole bunch more of these guys. I'm not going to go through all the colors, but we got more of these. These are each valued at $9.99 each. Crazy. So there's another one there. Vanilla and lavender. Um, man, oh man. Uh, honey almond, eucalyptus. So we got two more of those. I mean, there's a couple, there's like $300 worth of just these in there, guys. It's crazy. Got two more of them. We got two more of them. We've got one more. Oh, I can feel it. I feel it. Yes, we got two more of those. And what do we got here? We have some kind of a large kit. And this says, oh my gosh, this is huge. This is a yard sign that says USA. And it actually comes with all the little prongs so you can like put them here in your yard. That is really, really cool. And look, of course, there's only one of them in here. But you never know, we might get another one because then we can each get one. Okay, then it looks like we got more of these table runners. I guess these did not sell very well this year at the Michaels. So that table runner that we got, we have one, two, three, four. Looks like we have five or six more, sorry, more of these with a the little fringe on the end, but they are very pretty. I like those. 
Okay, then it looks like we got some bows. So this is just a Celebrate bow, and it's in that pretty mint green. That would look really pretty on a present or something, or on one of your um, little wreaths that you make. So we've got one, two, three. It looks like we have four of these, and they are valued each at $9.99 each. And again, guys, if you come up with ideas of things I can make, please leave it in the comments below. If it's not just for me, the other people that might read the comments may want to know as well. And if you know anything about soap and, you know, making soap, so the essential oil stuff that we just received, let us know other things that we can do with that. So we have that. And then we have, what are these? Oh, these are little charms. Again, it looks like just like little bottles with like a bunch of little beads in there. They look like those, um, oh, those little those little dots that used to go on paper and used to like peel them off and then you'd eat them and then they tasted like paper in your mouth. Yeah, I really like those. Mm -hmm. Don't ask me why kids love them, but we do. All right, so there's that stack. Now we're moving on to this stack. All right, so I know we gotta be at least halfway through. So who is still with me? Are you with me? Let me know in the comments below. Are you a true trooper yet? Are you? Let me know. All right, have you subscribed yet? If you haven't, hit that subscribe button. I'd really appreciate it. Help a girl out. And if you give me a thumbs up, take some time and give me a thumbs up on this video. I would love that as well. Okay, here we've had some assorted glitter glue. Ooh, I like those. That is $4.99. And it looks like here now we have some um, assorted glitter sets. So we have some glitter right there. Looks like we got a few more of those in this box here. So we got some more glitter right there. And these retail for $4.99 each. So we got some more glue right there, and then we got some more glitter right there, and then we've got some more glitter right there, and then we got some more of those oils. Man, they must have had a lot of those oils. Okay, then we have here class of 2021 cupcake holders, which is perfectly fine because who doesn't make cupcakes? We all do, and if they're just staying at home, you can still use them just fine. This says stickers finally done. <laughs> so this is a little thing where you can decorate your hat for graduation. Finally done, it says. Okay, then here, what do we have in this? This is a sticker graduation. These are $7.99. And I believe this has a hole in it. So you can actually put this like right on top of your graduation cap. And then you can like, I don't know if it's just like a shaker where all this stuff just comes through or not. And then it just says, yay. Like isn't yay. <laughs> we've got two of those. Nope, we've got four of these. And if you want to see it a little closer, because I know I can go kind of fast sometimes. That's what it is. And this is valued at $7.99 each. Start. And then it looks like we got a whole bunch of these. One, two, three, oh my, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh my, nine, nine. We have nine. I'm going to throw this over here. We have nine of these that just say class of 2021. And then they have the little stick here in the back. And guys, I'm thinking what I could do is I can paint right over these. And I could put like my garage sale signs. And then we can like just stake them into the ground. So yeah, I'm thinking that's something I might do. Because then, you know, those garage sale signs are super expensive. And those prongs, those are the best sticks to have. Because when you get those plastic ones and you're trying to push it in the ground, the plastic thing always breaks on you. Okay, and then we have congratulates, congratulates. No, congrats, grad. And it's another one of those signs with the little metal things here in the back. We got one, two, let's see. Yep, got another one. Hello, here you go. We got another one of those. We have another one. Oh, let me keep going here. One, two, three, four. And we got five more of these. So yeah, I think I'm gonna try to figure out a DIY to make garage sale signs out of those. And then we have some more glue. We have some more glue, glitter glue, might I add, which is even better than just regular glue. And we have that, and then that is the end of that box. So that stack is done. So let's move over to this one. Oh my gosh, guys, Ooh, that was a heavy one. So let's see if I can get this tape off of here because it is uh, stickied on there. Oh, ooh, <laughs> this is nice. August, 2021. This is awesome, guys. Check this out, and it is a calendar for your desk. And it's from the Happy Planner, and it's for 2021 to 2022. Why is this in a box? Because this isn't even outdated yet. That is so cool, and it comes with stickers and everything. Let's see, does it have a price on it anywhere? This has to be expensive, I would think. But I'm not seeing a price anywhere on it, but check it out. This is what it looks like. Let me bring it a little closer. And then it's got the months, and it actually starts in August. So it just, like, started. Usually the stuff that goes in these boxes is stuff that's, like, outdated or only has, like, a couple of months left. 
So we have that thing there. So that is like a really cool thing. And this says farm, farm civil? Farm what? Girl. Oh, farm girl. Oh, I missed that part. So it says farm girl right there. Cute. This is a sign that is $16.99. Okay, then we have the letter C. Can you give me a C? Anybody out there for $19.99? Who is a C? Too expensive to ship. Sorry, guys. Then we got a metal D. Okay, oh, this is neat. We have a Kodak, a Kodak, Kodak Premium Puzzles, a thousand pieces. Oh, and it's like a whole bunch of different kinds of front doors. That is actually pretty cool. I like that. That's a nice winter project. Okay, then we have by Kodak as well. It says um, Richer Truer Colors, and it's like a farm scene with all the fall colors. And guys, that's going to be happening in Michigan very, very soon. Okay, then we have our life, our home, our story, a little wooden plaque to put on the wall, or you can just hang it, you know, put it on a shelf. Okay, then we have in here, Sweet Tooth Fairy, and they're just like little sticks that you can put in like appetizers or something fun that you can get bite-sized. I'm not sure what, but I'm sure there's something. Then we have a children's face mask. We have another children's face mask. Let's see, I think we got like stacks of the face masks, because hopefully we are done with face masks, but if we're not, we got some supply for my nieces and nephews. Um, it doesn't even give a price on these, but there they are. And the white ones, I always thought you could always do is with the white ones, you could always like tie dye them. I thought that would always look kind of cool. Okay, then we have a couple of random flowers in here. A little flower, a little flower. We got some more of these fun little toothpicks here, which is adorable. And you guys, I don't know if you saw that video when I got friend mail, but Tiffany um, from Tiffany Wears T-shirts, she sent me a bunch of toothpicks. I mean, there was like a couple hundred of them in pink and silver, I think they were. And they all had little stars on the end. And I just thought it was adorable. And I have used them already, Tiffany. So if you're watching this video, I have used them. Sorry, guys. I don't mean to rattle on. Okay, another face mask. Um, there was something in here that isn't anymore. Then we got some more of these little cute little toothpicks there. We looks like we got a little craft kit here. It is the craft kit gem. And it looks like you are gonna, aw, it has to do with like little honeybees. So these are the little crafts that you're gonna make. So there's that one. And then there's another one that has like a little fox and a little bluebird on there. So that would be a fun project. And then here in the bottom, we have a painting square canvas panels. So it looks like this is something you paint. I don't believe it comes with the paints, but we do have one, two, three, four, five. And then this looks like this is a different design right here. These retail for, yeah. I wonder sometimes if they don't have price tags on them, like, do they even ever, like, make it onto the shelves? I sometimes wonder that. So there is that box. So let me get this box out of the way. We're going to move on to this box right here. Are you still with me, people? Let me know in the comments below. Are you a true trooper? Let me know. Okay, we have flowers. We got flowers. We have a basket. Okay, we got a random basket here which we can put all of these flowers in because this flower, guys, is all the exact same one. These each retail for $3.99. Crazy. So I'm just gonna kind of grab the whole hand flop because look, there's all of these and each one of these was $3.99. Here is like a, a little random one here that's kind of broken. We're just gonna shift that over. We're gonna do another shifty. We have here um, a little leaf right there. We have some little love, joy, ceramic figures so i don't know if this is like for that little dollhouse kit maybe Ooh, this looks cool coloring with clay very cool so this is like a little crafty kit here and it's valued at seven dollars and 99 cents and then it looks like maybe these are the projects that you're going to be possibly making so we have one of those we have two of these we have three of those okay then we're back to these um the little like dollhouse things that it says nook coin so we have that right there so these are just kind of like boxes here that go with that then we have we got more bubbles we have these glitter bubbles to go i've never heard of these so we got some bubbles we got more bubbles we have more bubbles we have more bubbles and then we have what spring um i don't know what this is for is this house plant i'm not sure what these are for they're coaster, maybe? i don't know if it's a coaster um, it says pink rose. Whatever it is, it's valued at $15 and it doesn't give us an idea. If anybody out there knows what these are used for, please let me know in the comments below. And there's another one right there. And then here is another, here's a couple more. These are like really cool looking. I just don't know what you use Maybe them for. Okay. And then we've got some 
more little charms, the little fuzzies. We've got some more of this cotton cord, more cotton cord. We have some more of the red, white, and blue little foil packets to like, you know, wrap candies or something in. We got some more foil packets. We got some more little pom-poms. And then we have, what is these? These are ceramic figures. And, oh, it looks like we got a watermelon, and I'm not sure what the other two things are. Maybe little eggs or something? I'm not sure. But can you see the little watermelon there? It's cute. I like me some watermelon. Okay, then we have a sign here in the bottom. Ooh, this could be very helpful. Measurement equivalence. So here is a picture that you could hang on your wall, and that way I would not have to ask Siri or Alexa anymore the measurements, because I can never remember, like, how many teaspoons are in a quarter of a cup or something like that. So we have that sign there. And it says here, stay grounded. So we've got another sign there. And, oh, a couple more things in this box. I thought we were done. Okay, then we have some little llama ceramic trays. Little llamas. Look how tiny they are. So I'm sure that's for that little dollhouse thing. And then the last thing in this box is the secret ingredient is always love. So, yes, we got us some love. So we have that one there. Okay. Oh, my gosh, guys. I can't even, like, move this box. It's so heavy. Uh oh What is in it? I don't know. Where did my scissors go? I found them. I found them. Here they are. Okay. Now. Ooh, sorry about that, guys. I am just trying to scissor up. I'm trying to scissor up these boxes. Okay. So this box here is still fighting with me and there we go okay now we got it so in this box it looks like we got some signs and that's why it's so darn heavy so secret ingredient is love this one has oh this is cool my friend is gonna love this it has an l on it and it says love grows here that is so Aww. cute that's gonna be perfect for my friend okay then we have follow your dreams yes we have that then we have another one of these right here, which looks kind of like it's one of those um, needle point. We have an A for apple. Then we have a sign that says, this kitchen is seasoned with love. I think we already got one of those, if I remember correctly. And oh my, okay. Then we've got these, I don't know, I think these are plaster maybe. Ceramic. There's ceramic, they are a bunch of letters. So that's what is making this box super heavy. So. I am just gonna like, maybe just pull the stacks out. There's all these, they're all different letters. These are each valued at $7.99, uh-huh. Ooh, there's an S for superstars. <laughs> had to do it, just had to do it. Okay, then we've got, oh my gosh, they put this on top of other stuff. I hope the other stuff didn't break. Then there's another stack right here. And then, man, yeah, I, I am sweating I'm now, I'm sweating. Then we've got, a bunch here. There's a W there and another whole stack. I'm not going to go through each one of them. Okay, this looks like it was a candle. As you can see, the candle is missing in action. So I don't know where the candle went, but it's not here anymore. So I'm just going to sh shift these over. Okay, then we have a sign. No, it's not a sign. Well, yeah, it's a, a picture, but it is the desert. What was your suggestion? I think you ribbon these together and make words. Oh, she's saying that these, because they have little holes in them, that maybe you would ribbon these together and then you could spell a word out. So maybe we can find enough letters to spell something. Usually we don't, though. Now we do have another sign here that looks just like the last one. We have the letter E. Can you give me an E? An E? Which way? I'm not sure which way it's going and which way you guys are seeing it. And I think I just got a splinter from my E, but that's okay. Then we have another one of these table runners with no um, no little attachment sign, but that's it. Oh, and then one random flower. All right, so there's that box. Okay, so now we are going up high. So now we're gonna go up here. And now this is like a smaller box, but I don't think I grabbed this box, my friend did. So she must have saw something fairly interesting in the box. Ooh, and now I know why. So I'm gonna take my glasses off for a minute because I is getting super hot, guys. Super hot. These lights are very hot in front of me. So we got a bunch of wax melts right here. We got an orange. We got orange. We got peach. Ooh, what's this one? Is this coconut? Um, crisp linen. Whenever I see white, I think of coconut. Then we have one here that's see something, but it's crossed off. You can't see it. We got another one. So actually, basically, we have a ton of wax melts in this box. And let's see. So that's why she got it, because we both love our wax melts. A bunch more here. Oh, which one is this one? This one is in uh, sea salt and sage. It looked different than the others. 
and then we've got some more there. And then also in this box, we have my first stamp collection. That is so cute. So it is like a little kit there. So, yep, that was definitely worth it. All these wax melts. And I think these value at um, $3. Nope, $3. Yep, $3.99 each. So definitely worth the price. Okay, going up high. Going up high. If I can. I'm trying. I'm trying. Ooh. Okay, so there we go. Whew. Are you guys sweating with me? Because I am. Have you taken a break and then you have to come back and see me? If you do, it's okay. I understand because there's just like so much here. Okay, we got another sign. Secret love. Does it say secret love? The secret ingredient is always love. We have an O. Oh, we have another little bundle of flowers. We have another one of these little, um, uh, I forgot what it's called now, um, dry erase boards. Oh, we got another puzzle. We got another puzzle that has um, some doors on it. So just like the last one. Oh, now this one looks really good, guys. Yes, yes, yes. It's all sweet treats. And I'm all about the sweet treats, you know. And then we got an L. Okay, then. Oh, we got some nice candles in this one. Oh, look at that. There is a beautiful candle. It's got, looks like some orange peels in there. Okay, then we did get some more of these little flowers in the vases. More flowers in the vase. Flowers in the vase. We got another um, uh, puzzle here. And this one is like a whole bunch of roses. That is gorgeous. Check those out. Very pretty. And then it has hot air balloons. I don't know if you could see that on the front. But it has a bunch of hot air balloons in there. So that would be a pretty one to put together. Okay, then we have the... Uh, it doesn't match, but there is another candle. Very similar to the last one. We got a little bundle here. And a cute little tin. We have a, another candle here, and this one uh, looks like some more flowers in there as well. Then we have, is this a matching set? Nope, it's not matching, but it's like little pillar candles there. And these are valued at $14.99 each. Crazy. And then we got a milk jug. <laughs> and we got one random milk jug. So that was everything that was in that box. Okay, now let's grab another box. And these boxes here that I'm getting into right now are a little bit smaller than the first boxes. So different stores box things up different ways. So let's see. What do we got in this one? We have a big flower right there valued at $4.99. We've got some more little random flowers here. We have, it looks like a, um, a plate. Uh, what are those? A little charger plate maybe. Okay. Then we have the letter T. Then we have the letter T again, I think, or uh, yeah, I think it's a T. Yep, I think it's a T. And then we have a little bundle of flowers. We got another little bundle, or nope, this is a little vase one. Then I have a S for superstars, yes. Okay, then, let me shift out. Oh, we got another one of these little metal tins here. We got another one that says, let's stay home. And then we got a cute little, um, little, uh, is this a turtle? I'm not sure what this is. This is a, I'm not sure what this little critter is right there, but it's on a keychain. It's a what? Sanitizer holder. It is? Mm -hmm. Okay, apparently this is a sanitizer holder, but I'm not exactly sure how. Oh, look at it Velcros, and then you can stick your little, <laughs> that's really cute. Or you can put a chapstick in there too, because I like chapstick. Okay, we got the, the um, roses with the um, hot air balloons again. We need another candy. <laughs> we want candy. <laughs> um, this one is the fall theme with the background of the country. Then we have the letter A. Then we have another one that says farm girl right there. Then we have another L. Love grows here. And then we have some more doors um, puzzles. And oh, this one's a little different. Now this one has a old car in it and it's got like a flag in the back and it's like old time. So that was everything in this box. And these puzzles, did we ever see how much these puzzles were? Um, I do not see a price tag anywhere on the puzzle. Nope. All right, guys, we're getting down. Oh, can you grab this? Let's see if I can pull it like over my head. Excuse my reach here. So this one is pretty light. So I'm assuming it's gonna be having some flowers in it. That is my guess. And I buried my scissors, but I'm back. <laughs> All right, so. Let me see what we got. Guys, it is going on close to an hour, and I apologize. So thank you so much if you are still with me. Okay, so this one here looks like this is what? What are you? It is a pride, and this looks like, oh, it's a DIY 
color changing tumbler. Oh, so maybe when you put the liquids inside it, then it's gonna go into the, you know, the pride colors here. So it looks like this whole box is gonna be pride stuff. So that is super cool. So let me get into this. So then we have another pride mug right there. This looks like we have a pride cape right there. So you can see this is what the cape looks like. And this is a value of $9.99. Okay, then we have two more of the same pride capes. Okay, then we have a t-shirt, it looks like. We have a, a adult large t-shirt, it looks like right here. So let's see, light pink and light blue. Now it does still say pride on it. Does Is that like a pride color? I'm not sure. I thought it was always like the real, you know, bold colors. But if you know, let me know in the comments below. But it's a nice t-shirt. It feels super soft. And let's see here. Do we have another one? We have, yes, we have another one. And this one is also adult large right there. Can you see it? Hello. I haven't done that in this video. Okay. And then what? We have another one. The same t-shirt. This one feels smaller. This one is a medium. Okay. Then we have, oh, this is kind of cool. This is a pride roaring with pride and it is a um canvas here and then it comes with the paint and the paintbrush and everything to put you know to paint this little canvas here so that's pretty neat okay then we have a pride um wooden sign that you can paint and then we have a bunch of pride hats <laughs> these are all valued at six dollars and 99 cents and we have one two three and four hats here Okay, then let's see. Oh, then we got a little pride unicorn <laughs> right there. We got another unicorn here. We got another unicorn. Oh, well, let me just grab them all. And then we have some little rainbow ears there. And then we have here another big old tutu right there. And I don't know if this is a child's or an adult. It is a, an adult medium. So we have a little tutu there. And then we have some more little... Um, little ears there with the little rainbows. Okay, then we got another cape. We have another tutu. <laughs> we have another tutu here. And you know, if you decide not to use this for the purpose of it, you could always, you know, take this um, off and then use this for other projects too. So there's always that. Then we just have a big heart tumbler right here. And I don't know if this comes apart or what, but it looks like, whoa, <laughs> did you see the thing spinning around? So this is the tumbler right there. And then it's kind of torn right there. So I don't know if it's just bent over or if it's actually broken, but that's all right. Oh, but then we got us some more 4th of July earrings randomly in our pride box. And then this is like a large object coming out next. This is the last thing in this box. If I can, it's actually kind of like in the box. And we have here some margarita glasses. Yes, so we got a set of, how many? It looks like there's going to be one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. It looks like we have eight margarita glasses. So you've got the stems of it is down here, and then you've got the cups over there. So that is everything that was in that box. Okay, then we are going to reach over to this one, and I think I've got one more over to my other side. All right, so we have that, and I've lost. There's my scissors. I found my scissors, guys. Stop looking. I'm good. I got them. All right, so in this box, what do we got? We didn't get much. We didn't get any school supply stuff. That's kind of weird. I thought for sure we'd get some of that. Oh, these are so pretty. Okay, so these are for Fourth of July, but they are the funeral um cemetery bases. And guys, I received a bunch of these last year. Not a bunch. We received a few, and I have been using them. I've been taking them um to the cemetery where my mom's at, and so this will be really nice for next year. So I can take it to where my mom and dad are. Okay, then we have a cool looking basket here that is actually lined. So it's ready, you know, for a plant to maybe go in it. And then it's got some like really cool looking feet here on the bottom, which is pretty neat. Okay, and then we have a nice beautiful bundle for 4th of July. Okay, then we got some more flowers here. We got some more greenery there. We have some more flowers here. And hopefully I'm showing this off to you guys okay. It looks like we've got some little hats and some little balls. I don't know if that's like for 4th of July. I don't know if you can see them through the plastic, but they are wrapped up. And it looks like they're all sparkly, so that's good that they're wrapped up. Okay, then we have like all these different flowers here. And just let me just grab one stem and give you a price. So, for instance, this one right here in my hand is valued at $9.99. Crazy. Cray cray. And then there's that. There's a cute little flower bundle there. And then in the bottom of this box, we have 
another girl power sign. We have another girl power sign. We have another, another let's stay home there. We have a huge like flower that you can like maybe attach to something. Then we have another big old flower that you can attach to something. Those are kind of crazy looking. This is some big flowers. And then there is a little block here and it says, let's cook. It says, let's cook right there. And what else? We got um, home, a story of where we are, a collection of things that we love. So there's like a little shadow box kind of looking sign there. This one's good at $19.99. And then we have some random die cut shapes that are for a graduate. So they're like little die cuts that you are going to use for like a graduation party. And I don't know, but it looks almost like they might have a sticker on the back. Okay, then we have happiness is homemade right there. And are you still here? Are you a super true trooper? Let me know in the comments below because I think I'm down to my very last box. Yes, I am. All right, so in this box, we have, oh my, what do we have? We have something that says kinetic foam, and there's a question mark. What will you do? And it says blue, and it's showing stretch entire. Okay, so I'm not exactly sure if this is actually going to make something, or do you make it yourself? I don't know, but we're going to have a bunch of these. So there's one. We have two. We have three, and does it give me a price on these? No, it does not, but there's three. There's four. There's five. There's six. There's seven. Okay, so there's seven of those, and then guess what? It looks like we got a bunch of the soft squishies, and I don't know, are these scented? I don't know if they're always scented or not. I know the ones that I had bought for my um, great niece for Christmas one year, they were scented. But there is like a whole bunch of these in here. These are, do they have a price? I don't see them, but they are some really cute ones. So it looks like here you got like a little cupcake, you got a little macaron, you got some little, uh, you got some cake going on there. You've got a beautiful looking cupcake right there. <laughs> uh, a macaron, you got another cupcake. We got, ooh, this looks like a, it's, it's heart shaped and then there's something in the middle and it looks really yummy and I wish it was real food, like sweet food. We got another cupcake. We got another one of these right here. Ooh, these are like little tarts, I think. Is this like a tart? That looks like a tart shell there and then like maybe like a strawberry tart. And we have, ooh, a cream puff there. Yeah, these are scented, they would be really cool. Could use them as air fresheners. We got more of these. So guys, I want to say the rest of this box, okay, I'm, I'm digging, I'm going in, I'm all the way in, and guys, let me show you, we have all of these, and these are all, <laughs> look, more and more and more and more and more squishies. So we have a whole bunch of squishies here. So let me know, did you make it to the end? Are you still with me? Are you a super trooper? Let me know in the comments down below. Again, if you haven't subscribed, hit that subscribe button. Give me a like on this video. If you get any extra time on your hands, I would love it if you could jump on over to Instagram, follow me over there. I'm trying to increase my followers and I'm kind of working on a little base over there and I'm trying to post a little bit more pictures over there. So if you could do that for me, I would so, so appreciate it. I wanna thank the freebie guy one more time because if it wasn't for him, I wouldn't even know these boxes were out and about. So if you guys wanna get these boxes next time they come around because they do sell out fast usually, but today for some reason they didn't, maybe because it was storming outside when we went. But um, if you do, make sure you go follow him as well. And like I said, I just appreciate each and every one of you. I'm sure I'll be able to put some items together for a couple of maybe little giveaways, but it may not be for a little bit of time because as you know, I just moved. I've said that like a million times. You're probably sick of hearing me say it, but I have and my house is totally trashed. So I do have to focus a little bit on that. Plus I'm a little bit behind on my other unboxings. So guys, thank you. Thank you so much for spending a little bit of time with me. Actually, it was a lot of time. So I owe you big. So thanks again so much. Please be safe, be well, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye. Bye.